Be on time. Be on time for everything. Why is being on time so important? Let's hit five top reasons for this today and starting with probably the most obvious one. Being on time demonstrates responsibility. This is a sign of moral maturity. In my parenting courses, I teach that there are three stages of moral development. At stage one, the earliest stage is very selfish, very self-centered. It tends to be demanding and entitled. Stage two is a little higher level. That's where we stop fighting and we start cooperating. We don't want any trouble. We want to keep the peace. We're willing to negotiate and work out a win-win kind of a solution. Stage three is the most mature of the three stages and it's characterized by responsibility and initiative and the willingness to serve and have empathy. Notice that this involves getting outside of your own mind and connecting with the impact that you're having on other people and systems in your world. So being on time demonstrates this responsibility, this level of moral maturity that you're able to not only track your own behaviors, but appreciate the impact that it has on other people. Which leads me right into point number two. Being on time shows respect. When I'm late, what am I really saying to other people? Oh, your stuff isn't important. My stuff is what's really important. It doesn't matter what you're doing. Not really. What I'm doing is what's important. See, that's the subtle message that is sent And it's not always even so subtle, is it? Sometimes it's in your face. It's as blatant as I just said it. That you're not important. I'm important. You wait for me. The respect that we demonstrate when we're on time acknowledges to other people that we see their schedule and their activities as being important as well high level of respect. The third point, being on time demonstrates humility. Humility, you know, as opposed to that destructive pride that we all have. I know, sorry to bring that up again, but we do. We get so stuck in our own perceptions and how prideful is it to say that I am so important and more important than everybody else. Now, I'm not saying you're not important. You are, just like everybody else is. So this destructive pride that I'm talking about is where we know that we're right, and we bulldoze through life with our own agenda without regard to what's going on for other people. Being on time demonstrates humility, your willingness to fit into the social fabric that exists out there as a contributor, yes, but not as the king of the world, this humility will help us to connect with other people and actually sets us up for point number four, being on time increases influence. It sets you up as a powerful contributor to the conversations that are going on. It shows in a subtle way, like we talked about in the earlier points, that you are morally mature, that you can respect other people, that you have a humility that allows you to actually be a powerful leader. People will look at you differently as you show up on time. Now let's take another little twist to this thing. Being on time has a whole lot to do with your positive mental health. And it actually symbolizes how you handle every other aspect of life. My friend and colleague, Art Coombs, who's been here on the show before, tells a story 
about our mutual friend, Kirk Weisler, who was interviewing someone about being on time. And the point that Kirk made to this person was, you're not just late for work. You're late for your life. You're late for your son's soccer game. You're late for your wife's birthday. You're late for your anniversary. You're late for your workout routine. You're late for breakfast. You're late for life. This symbolizes how you show up in your life. And beyond that, it's about how we think. Try this out for just a minute. When you think, oh, I'm late, I'm behind schedule, I'm not on time, and we get that way sometimes, don't we? In our thinking, in our goals, in our career, we think that we're behind, that we're late. What happens to your feelings when you switch that up and take this position? I'm right on schedule. I'm right on time. In fact, I'm a little early to the game. How does that feel? It feels totally different, which is a great reason to be on time. It enhances your own mental health to think, I'm right on time. I'm right on schedule. Now, it's a choice. I have had many opportunities to work with groups that have regular meetings. And it's so interesting to see how people handle being on time or not being on time. And you know what? It doesn't matter what time the meeting is. I've been associated with groups that meet early in the morning or late in the evening. And it doesn't matter. The same people show up late no matter what time the meeting is scheduled. It's not about what time the meeting starts. It's about what is your commitment to yourself and others? What is your level of moral development? When you take this seriously and start showing up on time, start being on time, it changes the game for you and for everyone around you. So it's not just about fulfilling the requirement. This is about our mental health. You can also power up your mental health through the positive personal development playlist here at Live On Purpose TV. I hope you'll check it out. Love I never, I saw standing in the street.